very good afternoon my friends how are you hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new live trading video from extreme trader this is Salah speaking uh, before we start this session I just need to clear one thing here I have seen some comments on YouTube uh, from followers saying that all these live trading videos I'm doing they are all on demo account and this is not live this is not real money that's why I'm always calm and relaxed when I'm losing a trade uh, of course this is not true all live trading videos on this channel are made on live account this is really my money here uh, I can prove it to you but uh, let me tell you the first the reason I'm hiding everything about the account is because the support has told me that it's totally not safe it's not secure to show the world on YouTube your account number you are putting yourself on the risk that's why I'm hiding it uh, just allow me to show you something here and forgive my very poor uh, video editing skills I'm just a trader I don't know how to make this uh, edit so look at the left here at the top to the left I'm hiding where the number will be shown and you can see that this is here IC markets live 12 this is my live account so all these trades you can see here are only based on live account but I'm only hiding it for security reasons and that's it nothing more than that let me just adjust it again and yes so again uh, last video was based on a Chimoku strategy and this video also I will make it based on this Chimoku because I, th I think we have made a lot of uh, 20 pips a day and hit and run so it's really more important to focus on each Chimoku strategy and the reason is um, it's really suitable for the beginners they feel it's more easier for them to find the support and resistance levels and of course for our new followers and viewers on the channel you can simply my friends go to this to my channel on YouTube click on videos then scroll down until you find uh, you know what I really should make a thumbnail for that here this one using Ichimoku for long-term trading that is the video you need to watch to understand what I'm going to do in this video you can also uh, later follow it with this live trading using Ichimoku earning 37 pips and I believe this one maybe I'm not sure so anyway uh, this is our trading session and let's start it right now let me try to find some setups here and to be honest with you I just want to save your time to not make the, the video so long so let me now pause the recording until I find a good setup and I'll be back to you my friends okay here is a setup I found <coughs> so let me show you this uh, on the four hour chart we can see that at Shumoku right now oh my god I forgot to, <laughs> to edit this one uh, just a second okay so on the four hour chart we can see that we are now above the blue cloud and we are also on a support level as the Chimoku is saying because we can see that we have here this this uh, sharp edge of the Chico span so it is confirming that I am on a good support level which is having a potential of a bullish momentum so go to the 30 minute time frame and let's see we have here let me just place the trade right now with the buy order so let me just explain to you the reason I placed this trade right here first of all we can see that we have here a support level meaning the trade or the market is actually bouncing from this level so the market is bouncing on this support level and also we can see that we have double bottom support here that is a, a pattern that indicating that there should be now a bullish reversal now of course not only that uh, but as I'm telling you don't just analyze your trades based on Ichimoku blindly you need to also use your knowledge about support and resistance that's why I was talking about these double bottoms here but if we want to follow the Ichimoku however we can see that we have here an edge of the Chico span which is sharp at the edge here that is indicating that the market here is showing a strong previously resistance level which is actually right here and that is bring me to tell you something I have seen some comments as well telling that you can use simply the line chart and that is the exact thing of the Chimoku or the Chico span now of course I'm not idiot I know that but the thing is you need to see the price action you cannot just trade blindly on that on that line chart without seeing any price action at all not only that but also the Chimoku is helping us deciding our trade based on the color of the clouds so it's really important to, to know these things so using the line chart is not really convenient it's not gonna help you it's better always to use the full strategy with the Ichimoku so you can see the candles with the price action and also you can see the line chart as well 
it's better than keep switching between candles and line chart like that of course so anyway go back to the subject the Chico span here is having a sharp edge at the top indicating that there was a strong resistance and of course we can see it right here so what we have here is a bullish breakout candle from this previous resistance and plus the Chico, the Chico span is telling me that this was a strong resistance and the market now is retesting this level so hopefully we can see now the market is gonna reverse and continue to go more up now the question is where should I place my take profit level however let's see this uh, the take profit level should be of, of course as we all know at the nearest support or resistance but this time I want to follow that Chimoko and the Chico span here is telling me that this is your nearest resistance which is of course this one here that's why it's really easy for the uh, beginning traders for the beginners to tell them where is the nearest support or resistance because this is one of the most common questions about the strategy how do you know the nearest support or resistance now Chico span can give you the, the best answer so again this is the resistance the nearest one here so we can set our take profit to be on this level let's see how many pips is that that is about five pips only it's okay if we are scalping the market and we can expect it to reverse only to hit this level and then it might reverse and go down that's the beauty about uh, scalping because you can always be safe because you can limit your trades uh, regardless if it's loss or profit it's always limited so in case of, lo of the loss will happen and believe me of course we lose sometimes so when the loss happens it will be very small uh, let's continue finding some setups here and I think I should pause the video again just to save your time because I know some people really don't like uh, long videos so allow me to pause and I'll be back to you my friends let's check out the setup here we can see that on the four hour chart we are above a very um, this is a weak level from the blue cloud so it's okay to place a sell order especially that right now we are on a resistance level so again this is a resistance level let's switch to the 30 minute time frame and we can see here that the Chico span is approaching a level where it was a previously a support level and also a resistance right here so actually this is a good level to place sell look at the left we can see that the same level here having a sharp edge of the Chico span telling that this was a strong level right here also and here as well so as a support or a resistance this level is showing you that this, this was a strong support or resistance and I believe even if we apply some Fibonacci we can see that this level was 61.8 and indeed it is 61.8 let me just uh, change the color now of course we need to make other videos for the 61.8 and a lot of people they will not agree with me of the way I'm using it but believe me it is working very well for me uh, maybe in the, soon in the future yes I will make one video about uh, Fibonacci I think I have made one already but uh, it's always better if we make another one with better or uh, more updated informations so again I have placed my cell here for the simple reason that it was a strong level as a, as a resistance and a support and uh, now where is my take profit take profit of course as the Chico span says it should be at the near support and this is the near support we can see right on this level and of course by uh, analyzing manually this is the, the nearest support so set my take profit right on it six pips of profit should be fine let's wait and see the market reversing uh, let me tell you that if that trade will go against me which most likely will gonna happen because um, we can see that we are you know just now I see it uh, that is the problem when you are making live trading videos on YouTube you just uh, make mistakes and that is one of the mistakes I have done right now uh, the trade is actually bouncing on the support level so what we can see here these two support levels most likely maybe the market will bounce but however uh, look, looking at the four hour chart it doesn't seem to be the market is going up to be honest it seems like we are, we are facing here a strong resistance level and the market should reverse at least to this previous support right here for 30 pips I'm just after six pips only which is fine it should be fine to be honest so yeah let's continue and let's see what will gonna happen but anyway if this trade will go against me I can prepare for another resistance level which is right here 
or maybe actually here yeah uh, let me just be more accurate like that so this, the candle might go against me but only up to this level for almost 10 pips I don't expect it to go more than that but anyway we can see that the trade now is going in profit and we have to wait for it to hit the tech profit and we will be good so let me now again pause the video and I'll be back with another trade so we can see right now the USD GPY is about to hit the take profit it is just like less than one pip away and I think I will just close it now with the profit of almost ten dollars nine dollars that should be fine uh, we can see this one is still uh, struggling with the reversal so however uh, let me now pause the video and I'll be back with another uh, trade this is a very interesting trade however this one is not using the Ichimoku this one using logic look at that the candle is approaching the very top of this uh, wick here on the left so this is actually a perfect perfect level for entry uh, of sell now this is the four hour chart go to the 30 minute time frame however we can see that the candle is almost exceeding this level I'm going to place sell and this should be really nice place for sell that is actually one of my favorite uh, setups this is just using uh, the manual analysis I mean for this one we don't even need a Chumoku at all we can just uh, use the manual analysis for this one so that is what I'm trying to explain always in the videos don't always rely blindly on a Chumoku always use your ma uh, manual ability or your mentality or your own skills whatever you you got it so however let's go back to the Chumoku and let's see if I want to follow Chimoku, where is the nearest support or resistance to this level? Hmm. Now remember this is the 4 hour chart. I need to check the 30 minute time frame to decide that. So the Chimoku is telling me that this is the candles here. And this is right here is the nearest resistance. So I just need to set my take profit to be exactly on this level right here. So I will set my take profit right on it. That should be about 13 pips of profit, which is actually awesome. So until this trade finish, uh, let me now pause the video again and come back with another trade. Look at the setup here. Uh, on the 4 hour chart, I can see that I am on a strong support level. That's good. Go to the 30 minute time frame. We can see that the Chico Span is telling me that this level right here is showing uh, a strong support because we can see this uh, sharp edge of the Chico Span. So this is right now is the good level to place by order. Immediately have been placed. Now let's analyze it together. Uh, since the Chico Span is telling me that this is right here a strong support level and looking manually we can see yes indeed you are right there is a support here. There is a chance that this thread might go against you so before you freak out just analyze the chart before that. Look at that chart. We see that we have here a resistance level and we have this bearish breakout candle, uh, sorry, this one here. So the nearest support level to this bearish uh, bullish breakout candle is actually two levels. First one is this one here. This is a support level and also right here. So if this trade, go, if this trade goes against me, I need to wait the candle to touch this support level. And if it does go against me again, and keep going down below to the support level that is my last the defense line so if the candle did not bounce on this support level most likely it will continue going more down and I cannot guarantee what will gonna happen it's better if I close it with the loss if I see the candle exceeding this support level and not only that but it should actually closes as the breakout candle just exceeding this level is not enough I need to wait to see the candle actually close as a, as a bearish breakout candle before I decide that okay I'm gonna close it with a loss however what about the profit of course it's Chimoku as, a, uh, as well telling us that this is right here is the nearest resistance so this is where you should place your take profit and I will make it almost nine pips because this is the nearest resistance that should give me about twenty seven dollars of profit so now we have three trades running let's check them one by one uh, Eurocad still struggling to the reverse and this one however uh, is going a little bit against me against me but I don't think it can go higher than that even on daily chart we can see that it's the top of the resistance again I'm telling you that is one of my favorite setups it's rarely failing 
uh, it might actually continue to go more up but I don't think it will go up immediately it has to reverse somehow just to retest this level before continuing going more up so now let me pause the video again and I'll be back to you to show you what, what will gonna happen with these trades we can see now this one already going in the profit uh, the euro uh, the euro pound so let's pause and I'll be back to you with another trade I missed to show you it hit the take profit just now euro pound and we have earned about eight pips I think about 26 27 dollars from that trade it was really good uh, no problem that was a good trade however the euro and ZD were still struggling with it uh, it's just continue to rise more up for almost seven pips uh, let's see I will not decide anything until the candle close it will close after 18 minutes from now after that we can decide if this trade should be closed with a loss but must but most likely it won't lose at all uh, this one however also hitting this resistance level so yeah I think I will pause the video right now and I'll be back to you to show you the final results of these trades all right so let's check what's happening right now uh, Euro and ZD is flying up right now but still again I'm telling you I will stick to my words I'm going to wait for the candle to close we are still 30 minutes away from the closure and I will wait for the candle to close before deciding if I will be if this trade will be on loss or not however this one as I told you it's going against me and let's see this one we are facing here a strong resistance level and the chico span is confirming that this is a strong resistance so that red is going against me meaning there is a chance of another reversal right here now I'm really sorry but because this is my my real account this is my money so I hate doing that but I'm going to do it anyway I will place another sell order here honestly I really don't advise it for the beginners but because I don't want to lose money here so I'm going to do it anyway and I believe uh, how we are still like one pip away that's fine no problem so another sell has been placed here now I'm really sure that it's gonna reverse the reason is we are seeing not only Chico spam but we can see that we are, we are facing here a resistance levels so the market is facing a strong resistance right here and this is on 30 minute time frame go to the 4 hour chart and we can see that indeed we are right now on a very strong resistance even on the past right here and right here so most likely the market is going to reverse at this point because following hit and run strategy we can see that this resistance has faced here a bearish breakout candle from the support and we can see that the market should actually reverse right here and continue to go more down so I believe this is uh, this trade is gonna be in profit but it's gonna take some time we will wait for it go back now to the 30 minute time frame and set my take profit to be exactly on the same level I will do that because I believe the market is going to reverse here so let's see the first trade which is in loss right now should give me about ten dollars of profit and the second one twenty two dollars of profit this one might be in loss however but I need to wait for the candle to close before deciding uh, let's see what will gonna happen and I will pause again and I'll be back to you my friends to show you what happened with these trades so let's see what's going on here we can see the euro cad is reversing indeed it's going down fourteen dollars one dollars I'm going to close this trade with a good profit now we are on three hundred ninety seven dollars of profit uh, sorry um, almost forty seven dollars of profit and let's see the last trade here as I told you it's going down it's reversing I mean even if the candle is gonna break out it's at least gonna go down to this level just to retest this previous resistance before it continue to shoot more up and we can see the resistance here is reversing it's indicating that this level is not as strong as you thought not only that but looking to the daily chart we can notice uh, not only this uh, wick here at the top uh, let's go more to the left and we can see right here I hope it's uh, clear for you my friends that we can see here a lot of wicks indicating that this level is as strong as a resistance and the candle should reverse here I'm not after long-term trades here I'm just after scalping just a scalping just give me a few pips and let me get out of this trade with the profit so that is the this is what I have found to be the safest way to trade Forex is just scalping the market aiming few pips and get out of it so how, look at that this is how so beautiful on the 30 minute time frame and the candle is about to close in just 25 seconds and it looks really nice it's uh, the price action seems to be gonna close as a as a pin bar which indicating that the market will reverse at this point 
so again uh, 17 minutes of the video let me now pause it again and I'll be back to you with the final results to show you what will happen with this trade okay let me tell you something that the market seems to me seems to be making a strong uh, bullish uh, momentum right now it's really not safe to stay in this trade anymore so I will close it right now with the break even it's all right that's totally fine because we have ended the video with almost fifty dollars of profit in just 15 minutes and that is totally good I mean I can continue scalping later after I finding some setups but I just wanted to share with you this quick uh, live trading session from my trades on my money however uh, thank you for watching my friends I hope that was informative to you and I would like to thank you for watching